morning folks. Thanks again for tuning in to Spartan Outdoors TV. Uh, today I'm going to show you guys how I like to clean my deer hearts and prepare them for cooking. Uh, I'm going to show you the whole thing straight from the field to uh, you know the final product. So uh, just shot this nice uh, seven pointer. Uh, not the biggest buck in the world but you know really proud of him. Just gutted him and I just took the heart out and uh, all we're going to do is put this in a plastic bag and uh, we'll see you back in the kitchen. Okay, so we got our deer heart uh, straight out of the field. Haven't done anything to it yet. Got some hair on there still. Um, what I like to do is cut this directly in half. The first part of cleaning it, just cut it in half. You don't have to. Uh, you can go through all these ventricles right here and clean out the blood that way. But uh, if you just cut it right down the middle, um, it's going to give you better access to cleaning out all the coagulated blood on the inside. And uh, yeah. So once we cut it down the middle, I just give it a little wash in the sink. Every little bit of coagulated blood, uh, anything that's white that you can pull off, pull that off. Okay, so it's already looking cleaner. And then what I do next, uh, I have a bowl here with a bunch of ice cubes. To that I'm going to add some salt. So what the salt's going to do is two things. It's going to help cool down that deer heart really quickly because once the salt uh, combines with the ice and a little bit of water, it activates and makes it really, really cold. Um, so yeah, you just want enough water to cover the ice basically and enough to submerge the heart. Uh, so once we put this in here, all that salt and that really, really cold water is going to help start uh, drawing out even more blood, blood that we couldn't get out just by uh, washing in the sink. Um, and so what I'm going to do is leave it in this ice and uh, salt brine for about 30 minutes, and then we'll go to the next step. Okay, so it's been about 30 minutes. Uh, I got our deer heart in here. All that ice is melted. Just going to pull them out. And you can see just how much has come out of there. You know, even additionally, all that salt pulling the blood out. Just going to dump that off. And now the next step here, um, you'll see all this connective tissue on the inside. You'll see this white fat on the outside. Uh, and you'll see this lean red muscle meat. Um, so basically anything that's not red, we want to cut out. Um, at the same time, you know, you don't want to be careless just because, you know, hearts are small. There's not a ton of meat on them, so make sure you make your cuts uh, nice and accurate. You don't want to waste too much of the heart. The trickiest part of all of this is going to be getting this white membrane out on the inside. You basically just want to find where it starts and kind of run your knife underneath it like you're filleting a fish. It comes right out. And so now you see here, uh, this is a heart that's ready to be cubed up, chunked up, whatever you want to do with it, thrown on the grill. And this other half, you know, you can see the difference. Um, and then we're just going to repeat with this side, take off that fat. that membrane off the middle, off the interior. And like I said with that membrane, you see where it starts here, kind of like roots of a tree. Cut a little bit there uh, where they begin and then just kind of run over it like you're flying a fish. Now, uh, I just did this quickly for the video. Uh, you can get really nitpicky with it, but there you go. This is two halves of a deer heart uh, ready to go, ready to be cooked. And uh, yeah, it's just really quick and easy. Uh, don't make it something, you know, intimidating. Um, and try it, try it out next time you kill a deer. Don't leave it in the woods. <laughs>